Welcome to Las Vegas Martin Kung Fu Channel. This is Sifu JJ. Today, lesson the Nan Dao Sword and Sword. Section 1. It's great weather today, so let's start our lesson. So, how to hold your sword? So, in Nan Dao, you look, this part is really different than normal style of sword. So, this part is very different, and this is handle part is the same, your right hand grabbing right here. So this part, how you hold by your left hand, your fingers under, grabbing, and your thumb to hold this part. So this is how to hold your sword. And when you transfer, your right hand will take over like this. We have few basics before we start this lesson. So follow me. So in Southern Sword, we do cut from the right to left. So you go, since the direction for the last point, so you cut flat and you twist since because this part is not a blade, it's safe. So a lot move, you go attack your body, it's okay. The same thing, you go one now on your bike, this is really safe, and you come back. So that's is different between straight sword, two blade sword called a straight sword. So this is a Black sword. So one side of the blade. So the blade is right this side. So you attack by this side. So this part you can to go attack. Attack. So this part you can attach your body. It's so sick. Also, we got to work on the flowers. Right hand right here. Right, right hand right here. Relax your wrist. One two go down three go back almost touch your right shoulder and come back that's the floor we go one two three four perfect let's say this side always stay the same line to so cut the line and go down and go right shoulder and come back let's start our tutorial so your left hand hold your sword remember how to hold that right so we go this back straight and on both sides so ready with both hands on your waist and you make a big step at the same time open your sword and your right hand your right hand become a palm straight and your toe go this way and you little bit go down and you start your left your right hand and push forward like this so this is a high empty stance high empty stance as we mentioned before in other lesson, your heel up, your toe, all weight, right, this leg, your body stay center, straight, like that. And the next move, your right hand to take over this sword. And you make the flower as we learning, one, two, three, and you lift at the same time. When you land, your right, you hold your sword. This is a blocking move. At the same time, you just follow by this leg and go low. This is a protection move. You go right here. Okay, restart one more time. Follow me. Ready? Go one, stop. And two, slow and push. Your energy and your right hand. You got your sword. And you go forward, knee left. You step to right. And you close hand from down. Once you pull this way, you turn your sword. The blade go up and like that. Great work. So now we continue. Close hand open. So you go. So this cutting move, as we mentioned before, is the same. Your blade go this way. Then you go in like this way. Then you step your right. See how the sword cut back flat like this. And you turn your wrist come back it's this way because you're ready for next move your sword turn back this way this is the same part your left hand can pass right so rocking like this right side just your palm right there so you step your left 45 and you go over your sword at the same time you step two like this then you make a big strong step just like you do nan quan you twist by this way and you go <laughs> And that is the more power once you go push your sword, your left hand will be assist to help more power.
with this one. Open to go cut and step your right and cut. Then you step your left, your toe go this way, 45, and shoot. Make a circle and you step your left, stay low and power. Jump. So for first part of this video, steps is very important. We know this empty stance. Then flower and you pull back. Your leg follow, you stay low. After your toe always go 45 and you step 45. And you count the same thing 45. And then you step. So your direction is towards to straight, but your steps always 45. And you make 45 step. Then another big step 45. And you go push. So after this, we do a flower again, fit together, and you step your right. Your sword attached on your uh, arm, and you pull back. Like the opening move, but this is ball stance. You push through your knee, become ball stance. At the same time, your sword attached on your arm. So after this, you open your ball's arm, it's the same move, move like before. You step 45, and you go cut this way, and you go boom, twist right here. And you step to right 45, you cut, and come back this way. Then you make big step left, and the hand to go push right here. So for this last move, your sword push like this. You left on on the top, your sword flat, you go push like this way. So the same thing, the first one, you go cut this way and you go boom, twist. Because this part is not a blade, it's safe. So you can attach your body. And you cut flat blade and you turn back this way. So flat level. With this way, because you're ready for next attack, going to like this. So left side of your body, your feet again. You step your right and you go step left. You have a first dance, your sword to right here to protect your head. After this, you stand up, your sword twist right this way. So you go small, cut down. And quick twist your wrist because you're ready to cut a bigger one this way. So from top, you are tear your toes and you go. So once you make that quick, the same thing, you cut straight with your blade and you turn your wrist and come back to this way. So always remember this is a safe. That's why we got this. So after you got to cut small and then cut big. And after you make a big cut, then you switch your feet and two. And then come back to straight and you cut down with 45. Then this is that. So after this one, stand up, push palm, you make a step left, step right. Then you go swing to do a, a tornado kick. Go, tornado kick, you land your right. So you come back your wrist and you go attack. So with your knee down, like this position. This is the first section of Nan Dao, the first section of Nan Dao, the sword and sword. So follow me from the beginning to get again. And you go cut left, cut right, you step your left, knee down, attack. After this, sword fit together this side. And you quick switch with your first step. 
Bow cut. Left small. Cut. Right. Bow cut. Front. And you come back with a simple. Stand up. Stop. Left. Right. Hit. That's all for the Southern Sword Tutorial. So, we you got your movement only the first step. So there have many levels you need to achieve. So tonight I will training in other location by self improve training with basics. So follow me another video for the real training with basics. I see you in next video. And bye bye.